Hello YouTube, it's John Kendrick TV and I'm here to bring you a tutorial video of how to install Diggs Eminence Real the Bread build on your Kodi 17.6. Um, first you want to go to settings and go to turn on the unknown source. Um, make sure this is on. Mine is already on so I didn't have to do it. Then you're going to go to your file manager and you're going to go to add source. You're going to make sure you type in this, uh, this web address into this uh, link. Um, I am running an Apple TV. This is Cody 17.6 build. Um, this is the Apple TV 4K. I'm running tvOS 11.3. Uh, I don't really have any problems with it. By the way, it's 64 gigabytes. I don't really have any problems with it. Um, I never run into um, any lags, any buffering, anything like that that's severe enough to where I'm dissatisfied with using Cody on the Apple TV. Um, shout out to anybody who has it on the dig on the shield or anything like that, Fire Stick. Um, but yeah, you want to make sure you put this web address in the uh, top of the description and just name it dot digs. It really doesn't matter. You can pause the video after I close this out if you need it. Um, go ahead and and push OK. I didn't need to do it because I already have it. You're gonna go back to the Cody main screen and you're gonna go down, you're gonna go to add-ons. Once you do that, you're gonna click at the top left and you're gonna um, go to install from zip, okay? Now here, you're gonna just go to the file to whatever you named it, I named it .dig. So you go to install repo. And then once you do that, you're just gonna go ahead and choose the only option, the repository. Uh, mine moves pretty fast, so it doesn't take long to install. Um, look for it at the top right. Go to install from repository. Go to Dead's repository. Then you're going to go to the Chef Wizard. Well, program add-ons. And then the Chef Wizard. Um, install this. Give it a moment. Um, now here, um, I did not go to the configure. It just popped up. That's just a pop-up. Um, so you just want to go ahead and dismiss everything and um, do exactly that. Uncheck all those boxes or bubbles. Leave the last three, um, you know, filled in. Press continue. Ignore. Now you can go ahead and open it up. Um, once you're on this screen, you want to go to the builds. And you're going to choose Eminence Real Debrig version 2.1. You're going to want to go ahead and first install it. If you already have a build, if you don't, you can go ahead and do a standard um, standard install installation. Now, this is my favorite build at, at the moment. Um, it has everything I need. Um, it's very convenient for me. It's very user-friendly. It's smooth. It looks great. Um, it, you know, uh, adds that little... Uh, you know, the customization to your, your Cody experience that makes it look, di look different. Um, everything is very well put together. Um, and so once it's done installing, it's going to automatically force close Cody. Don't trip. Just open it right back up. All right. Yeah, so give it a little moment. You can go ahead immediately back into it. Um, if not, just give it a little moment. A little while as soon as you open it sometimes the skin doesn't take effect automatically uh, if i would have been patient a little while i would have gotten this message before going into settings because i was about to manually change it but it automatically does it once it's done loading after you open it back up all right so what i'm doing now is just giving it a little while to uh, finish loading as i've seen that it was still installing and, and setting up some things then i'm going to go to the main screen and I'm just going to go through some of the sub menu, menu items um, and show you what's available. Okay. And as you already can see, there's been some some changes already made. You have your movie portal, um, your TV portal, your latest movies, uh, your horror zone, Hulu originals, Netflix originals, 
and your Amazon Prime Originals. Now, for some reason, that widget didn't load up. Sometimes it does do that. Um, it's just going to be some settings you need to make sure you update. I'm going to show you how to do it after this video, maybe in another video. Um, here, I'm just scrolling through the different uh, movie options that you do have available. Um, when you click it, it's not going to automatically play. You will have some forts that you can choose. Um, Scrubs, SDS Redux, um, Siren, and uh, Yoda, I believe. You know, you know some of the uh, popular ones. Uh, and you can choose whichever one you prefer. And um, yeah, that's pretty much everything this bill has to offer. Of course, you do have, um, you know, Prime TV and Gears TV or Gears Reloaded that you can have set up on here to where you can watch live TV. Um, in another video, I'll show you my setup with that I have as well. Um, I do use Gears Reloaded. This, again, is my favorite build. Uh, you can't really go wrong. It's the perfect setup for me. I have movies available. I have TV shows available. I have Netflix, Hulu, Amazon now. Uh, and I have live TV as well as music. So you really can't beat that. And with this being set up on the Apple TV, man, it's, it's, it brings you the ultimate experience. I'm not saying you necessarily have to have a, uh, an Apple TV device. You can have a uh, Fire Stick 4K. You can have um, the T95Q, which is an Android media box. You can have the NVIDIA Shield, which is, you know, pretty much rivals the Apple TV uh, 4K. Um, in some ways, whatever you prefer, whatever ecosystem you, you're in, if you're in, in Android or Apple, I prefer Apple because all of my devices are Apple. Um, but yeah, man, it's, it's smooth. It doesn't give me any, any, any kind of problems. Um, again, not saying that uh, if you're on an older device or a lower end device, um, that it's going to be this type of an experience for you. You do want to make sure you have a um, device that's capable of running this build, which I recommend anything three gigabytes RAM and more uh, with anywhere north of, uh, let's say, 32 gigabytes to start out with. OK, and here uh, I did go into the Amazon Prime just to show you that those shows are available. Even if the widget is not showing, you can still use it and access it. Um, it has all the um, hottest and latest Amazon Prime original shows out right now if you have any questions if you have any requests um just hit me up uh message me or leave a comment please like subscribe comment and share um, i am new to this but i will only get better at it uh like i say any requests just let me know and i'll, I'll work on it I'll, I'll look into it for you uh, i'm just giving an overall review quick review preview of this bill. It's John Kendrick TV. You guys enjoy the rest of your day.